many people want to know, how does a stone skip across water? Well, I'm Tanner Reckledge, and uh, I'm going to teach you how to do that and explain a little bit of the properties of skipping stones. <laughs> Just sitting on okay. uh, This is what you don't do with a stone. Do with a stone when you want to skip this it. Is, this is how you really skip a rock. Oh. This is the kind of stone you want to use across the water yeah. because it's small and it can glide right across the lake. Uh -huh. And this is a rock that you don't want to use because it's big, it's round, it's heavy, and um, it won't glide across the water. This is a small, thin rock. Bada bang! And uh, this is the rock you don't want to use. I'm going to try to skip it. Bada bing. Stone generates the lift as the same matter as a flying dick by pushing the water down as it moves across the water at an angle. Surface tension has little to do with it. Matt, what are you doing? What's our uh, bouncing bombs? Little frogs. Uh, frog jumps. Uh, skipping rocks. By the bing. Brian, what are you doing? Of the game, skipping a stone, is to see how many times you can get it to skip across the pond, lake, ocean, river, etc. Pond, lake, river, ocean, etc. Without <laughs> uh, stone skipping is a game which involves throwing a stone across the water and making it bounce as many times as it can. Darren, what are you doing? Huh? I'm